This is your CBS 46 News Update, brought to you by West Shore Home. Good afternoon, I'm Rob Hughes. Today, the world is marking one year since the World Health Organization officially declared COVID-19 a global pandemic. According to a new AP poll, one in five Americans have lost a relative or a close friend to the disease, and about one in three Americans do not intend to get vaccinated. Good news for medically fragile Georgians. They're finally eligible for the COVID vaccine starting Monday, which means we'll start seeing a new batch of Georgians at mass vaccination sites. The new phase, which starts March 15th, includes those age 55 and up and those 16 and up who have a wide range of medical conditions that make them medically fragile, including asthma and even pregnancy is included. For a full list of who is eligible starting Monday, you can check out the story on our website, cbs46.com or on our free app. The U.S. Department of Justice warns of fake websites and Facebook pages for those seeking assistance. It's so bad that all 50 labor departments are meeting with Facebook today. And it's not just Facebook. Scammers are using Twitter and LinkedIn as well. You can make an appointment on the Labor Department's website every Monday at 8 a.m., but they only have 1,500 slots per week, so you have to act fast. And the group behind the Atlanta Beltline is moving forward with a multi-use trail route that would connect the west side to Buckhead. Atlanta Beltline Incorporated announced plans to study routes for the Northwest Trail. Once it's finished, it could link several pathways, including the nearly 64-mile-long Silver Comet Trail. All right, today's the perfect day to take a walk really anywhere. Meteorologist Fred Campagna with a look at today's forecast. Yeah, just get outside, enjoy it. Temperatures in the 70s this afternoon. Nice and mild out there. It'll fall back through the 60s this evening. Not a very cold night, though, uh, for us. And the warm weather continues on Friday. High of around 77 degrees. Looks like upper 70s in Atlanta and points southwest over the weekend. Northeast Georgia may be a bit cooler. Lots of clouds on Sunday. Our next best chance at any rain is not until late Monday and into early Tuesday. This has been your personal news update from CBS 46 News, brought to you by West Shore Homes, Atlanta's one-day bath remodeler.